This is a little video I'm making for Vesta. So I'm going to come and, and open up this file right here. It's just any file. Click open. Here's the file. Come over here to export DXF. And it wants me to issue a style name or number. And so I'm going to call this KK delete. So I'm just going to delete it. <coughs> Let's call it KK1 delete. <coughs> and you can pick any number of formats here, standard AAMA, Gerber, Pad, AutoCAD, Illustrator, depends on whatever it is that somebody wants. So Gerber is the most common, so I'm going to stick it in Gerber. And this highlights up, I'm going to click all, and that's all there is to it. Now you need to, the only thing I don't like is how um, StyleCAD sorts these styles where it puts them when you're done. I would prefer that it just went right into the um, standard fold, the parent folder of that customer. So anyway, um, it gets stuck into the DXF folder here, and then there's the file right there. And that's the one that you would send to the customer. Let's do it again. Let's do it for AutoCAD. The file is still here. And export DXF. It wants another name. We're going to call this one KK1 delete 2 and do this in for AutoCAD. Again, I just leave all of the defaults. I don't change anything. Click OK. Click OK. And that's all there is to it. StyleCAD is pretty awesome when it comes to exporting these files. Let's do another one. Export DXF. I'll call KK delete. Three. Oops. Okay. And let's put this one in Illustrator, which is kind of a pain in the butt. You have two Illustrator file options. Okay, and I learned the hard way. This one up here does not work. It just makes a really junky file. I don't know what the problem is. But you can put it in this old version, and that seems to work pretty well. So I'll click OK. Again, select all the piece names that go into it. <coughs> Click OK. That's all there is to it. Come over here and you can go into um, DXF folder and see all of these files. So what I would recommend, consider recommending, let's delete that one. Um, this one is an AutoCAD file, so I would actually call this AutoCAD. And then this one right here is an Illustrator file. So I would call this one Illustrator or something like that. That's it. Hope that was helpful. Bye.